Hello beautiful souls, this is for the collective reading. So take what resonates and leave the re what doesn't. Okay, I heard uh, okay, I was channeling a message and I heard someone is going to offer you something. Okay, so this flip. So we have the door to value. It might be money that is going to offer you something. Someone is offering you a lot of money, abundance, blessings. And doors are opening up to you. What else? Yes, the garden of the gate. You've been waiting for this for so long. And um, yeah, that's what I've said. Doors are opening up to you. There are a lot of opportunities here. Adjustment possibilities. You just need to choose one. And your advice is to choose wisely. Number 31, 30, and 24 might be significant as well. What else? Oh, the thinking woman. So, might be you're overstressing right now. Overthinking. What else is your message? Oh, we have the envy here. Or the deceit, yeah. And with the goddess of the moon, there is someone that is jealous. This is someone who is not um, showing their true self okay with the moon right here the goddess of the moon i feel like for some of you you are very in tune you are very intuitive so um you feel like this person is yeah there is a mast here okay be careful what you wish for you have the indecision right here and you also have the okay financial constraints might be that this person is so be careful with the person that you are going to trust may take you to another direction to the wrong direction and it may cause loss of money as well we also have the action so you just need to listen to your intuition here and you also have to balance your third eye chakra uh, i mean third chakra Archangel Kamel. So I have this message like I feel like this person um this is a temptation as well when you say about that when we talk about the third eye chakra the third chakra okay I'll just I will I keep on talking about third eye okay what is the message again okay be careful with the Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius sign. We also have the Taurus and 